I grew up in Syracuse, New York. I did not feel like there would be pressure to be anybody other than myself. The tug of war was about my sexuality and how much of that I was willing to like literally strip down. I never wanted to be objectified while doing my music. And it was very much like, and you know, and like, and I don't even like, I'm like, stop. Where's your voice? Where are you? Like a lot of the music and the rap, it was very degrading. And my 20 year old self knew that it was degrading, but the beats were so crazy. And when you walked in the club and it's like, first before any gimmick and uh, before any, you know, materialism. This really deep brother-sisterhood was starting to get affected by the machine. I didn't want that burden on my shoulders. And I just need you to know I'm happy for you. Like, you did it. He spilled and he was like, I really miss you. It's different. And um, I just knew we'd be fine. They deserve it. They deserve it. I was there for that part of hip hop that was kind of the last of it, you know? And, um, like no one can ever take that. I have my happy. <laughs> <laughs> 